when it comes to the outcome and the results, it will differ from country to country. I think uh, Tunisia may stand a chance of uh, getting it right. Egypt has challenges. It's a big country. It has, uh, apart on top of the political problems, there are going to be serious economic problems. You know, this is, this, these are countries that have lived on tourism. The tourists have stopped coming. Investments are not going in. Uh, reserves are dwindling. And so if you are not careful, you will get to a situation where you will have not just political problems, but economic and social and financial ones, which makes it uh, uh, messy. And the leaders who take over immediately get challenged. What have you done for us? Why are we still in this situation? And you are also dealing with a, a newly acquired freedom and new sense of independence and new sense of democracy. And they will assert, you know, I, I always go back to the comment of uh, Amatya Sen, who as a young boy went through farming in India. And he says, people in democracies do not starve. They will get rid of you. They know how to challenge uh, the leaders. And, and this is something that we need to bear in mind as we see uh, developments in the region. What is also interesting is so far, the, the most organized and cohesive force appears to be the Islamic Brotherhood. And when you have this sort of confused situation, the organized always wins the day. And they, they've done well in Egypt, they've done well in uh, Tunisia. I would not be surprised if they do well uh, in, uh, in, in, in Syria. And this sometimes gives the impression to people that you're, you're having a, a hegemony that is emerging. Although I, I believe that the West should be a bit more relaxed about the fact that uh, Muslims or Islamists are becoming prominent in politics. It's an Islamic nation. It's a bit like going to Italy and saying you don't want to see Catholics in politics. <laughs> you know, you're dreaming. But the main thing is how do you work with them and shape things and move it in the right uh, direction?